What it do, baby boo? Yeah, little mama, you looking good. Loosen up my buttons, baby. Uh-huh. But you keep oh. wrong. Uh-huh. Say what you gon' do to me. Uh-huh. But I ain't seen nothing. I'm telling you. Tamen Frame Brow in 05. Um, I do a lot of brow stuff, so you know how it goes. It's just filling them in. And then the LA Girl Pro Concealer in Fawn underneath the eyes. But then on top, I'm going to go in with the NYX the Concealer Pot. And this one is Nutmeg on the top. And then I'm just blending out the whole eye and making sure that it's just all one color ready for eyeshadow. So for the eyeshadow, I'm actually using a Colourpop eyeshadow. This is in Bandit. And then I'm going in with my Fashion Fair. This is actually a blusher. It's called Tangelo. It's like a nice reddishy, orangey, cheap type of colour. I don't know. It just looks really cute. And it's very vibrant and very pigmented. So I really like that. Then I'm using the Maybelline Master Ink Liquid Eyeliner. This is matte and I'm just making a really thick winged liner I feel like because my eyes are like so hooded like these eyeliner looks better the eyeliner look looks better yeah then I'm using a white eyeliner from MUA this is snow white so just lining the eyes with that and then I'm going to be using some nice beautiful lashes these are from Tasha Akin Duro they're called Cleopatra very beautiful lashes I love her lashes then I'm just gonna spray my face with the NYX setting spray the Jimmy one ready for my foundation I feel like it helps my foundation to glow to go on better but yeah so this is the Revlon color stay foundation in cappuccino so that's what Shan will be using to blend out her foundation then I'm using the matte pep and prime peach luster Did I say pep or prep Prep and Prime Peach Luster just for a bit of highlight. I don't really like my highlight to be too bright anymore. Like I just feel like I look scary. So I'm just wetting my beauty blender and just going to dab that in. But obviously I'm not going to show you the whole thing because who wants to sit there and watch someone blend for ages. So I'm going to use a little bit of my LA Girl Concealer in Fawn. Just like add a little bit more brightness but not too much. I don't want to look too crazy. And then I'm using this Stay Matte from Robo London. It's a translucent powder to set my under eye. I prefer this than a Sasha Buttercup than anything. I just prefer this. It works for me. And it's cheap too, like £2 or £3. 
but it's not on, it's not over five <laughs> but you just can't go wrong then i'm using my fashion fair cosmetics bold lash mascara this mascara is actually really really good i don't give them enough props it's really good then i'm going back in with bandit from color pop just underneath the eye to kind of blend it and smoke it out because um, i smudged my mascara a bit so that always helps with a good trick just use some darker eyeshadow there and i'm using the kiko wet and dry shadow this is 200 so I'm using that for my highlights, that's going to be in the inner corners of the eye, it's going to be on my brow bone, it's going to be my nose highlight, my cheek highlight, everything. But yeah, I'm going to contour with this Lee Contour Palette in dark. Something really quick, nothing too extra, my eyes are already extra, so yeah. Contouring that nose, so then back again with the Kiko shadow as I was saying. I'm just basically just like you know using that to highlight everywhere you know everybody uses that Kiko shadow I think it's 210 to kind of um, highlight their skin but that one was very light for me so I had to go a bit darker and this works perfectly for me so I just stick to this you can't follow everybody not every color will suit you just like it suits everybody else so you know this worked perfectly for me so then I'm using the MUA matte lipstick this is called I think it's just fancy However, I just feel like it's just so chalky and it's so weird, but for a pound, what do you expect? Then I'm using the Colourpop liner, this is Pitch, just to line the lips to kind of blend it out. And then I'm using Soap and Glory Sexy Mother Pucker. <laughs> so I'm just using that to kind of, you know, blend everything in and to create a nice sheer gloss and it literally stings my lips, but after a while it wears out, but it's just such a pretty colour. Now set the face and for the hair! So all I'm doing is just taking off my bandana and I'm just like, you know, then I comb in the hair, I'm going to tease it, add some concealer and I'm just going to like, you know, fluff, zhuzh it up a bit, not fluff, zhuzh, zhuzh that thing up a bit and then I'm ready to go. Yes, boo boo. guys i hope you really really enjoyed my video i thought i'd do something different i just want you like to see the real me and before i felt like i was always just stuck to reviewing wigs and i had to be professional and boring and blah blah blah, blah. and i guess it finally took me a year to actually realize this is my channel i can put out what i want i can be me it's my channel i'm not employed by anybody but myself so um yes yeah, so this is what um I'm doing so one thing I love to dance even if I can't do it well I'm gonna this try wig, yeah it's from honey queen hair I feel like a queen in this wig it is really long it's just so beautiful I'll leave all the information in the description bar below but I'm definitely gonna be working with this company again like I like it when I get really really nice wigs because when I get really crap wigs I really do stress on how I'm gonna fix the hair but um it look nice it look fresh and can you see like the front bit what i had to do was i can't be asked to um bleach the nuts and stuff like that so what i had to do was i plucked it just to let you know this actually came pre-plucked but i plucked it even more like an idiot and then when you saw at the start of the video like i had this much gap of lace so i just to cut that bit off and then um just yeah but i also tinted to do it with tea bags and that was it and just plucked it a bit more didn't need to and yeah i just curled it because we slick Hey. So thank you so much for watching my video guys and I will see you in my next one, okay? Make up on yourself.